Uh, these hoodlums, these criminals went to vandalize them. That is but some let, this let is me ask you this. Now, at some, uh, we, we know that uh, there was a, um, some sort of, I think the ministry, humanitarian ministry, on, in April, yeah. April this year, the state received some palliatives from that ministry. And then, you know, others were received by the government from Kakovic. So if you were not on the same page, number one, why is it that the governors couldn't say, look, I'm, I'm not on the same page with this. I don't agree with this. We don't have to be forced to abide by these things that we are not happy with because you're the number one person in the state. You are responsible for your state in terms of how things go. So how come you didn't say, well, look, if you are bringing it in and we're not happy with the way you're bringing it, set up your team, your agency, whatever it is in the states, go ahead, distribute these things yourselves, as opposed to leaving them in the warehouse for months and then you had to come to this. We did not receive those materials in April. Those materials were not received in all the states, or majority of the states in April. Some of them were as late as even September. Yes, this September year. 16, and some and of them uh, April. Remember, exactly, exactly. And because it is what we, Kogi State, that's what we do. If you look at those materials, they're not just COVID items, especially from these warehouses. There are others food stuff that on our own, we have purchased to take care of, I mean, uh, IDPs, motherless, I mean, uh, homes, less privileged. What we, this is what we do periodically. And only to realize that even the COVID stuff that were provided or supplied are already expiring. And then I have to order them that, look, add it to what we are distributing and share it across the local government. Mm -hmm. And they were done very smoothly. And I want to believe so also other states. So it is not as if governors are hoarding those items. But please, let me quickly go into this. These are just one of the effects of this so-called COVID-19. Let's not 